Hey, what's going on, people? I'm going to be showing you how to do action swap with one pause or more, depending, you know, on how good you are or how comfortable you are with the trick. Um, definitely getting the trick is important. Um, it's only 15 seconds faster to do action swap, optimally, but it is worth it, uh, in my opinion. Um, so first, you're going to have the Eclipse hook shot, stick, and bombs. I'm going to do it first without explaining it, just so I can get it and show you. Quick draw, target. Did you hear that? So that's the frame in which you match stick on. So what I did was quick draw, targeted the wall, um, side hop, press hook shot after side hopping, and then pretty much buffered till I hear this text. So this is the frame in which you need to press stick to get action swap. Press stick, hold down, target. This will equip eventually. If you want to break these ice clothes, just bring the stick back to neutral. The control stick. And that's it. Let me do it one more time. And I'm going to show you exactly where to target. But most important is quick drawing. And you're going to target actually to the left of this hook. So right around here is fine, or around there. You want to make sure you target, side hop, press hook shot. Did you hear that? The boing? That's Navi text, basically activating. So that's the audio cue in which you want. Um, and you're gonna press stick. Hold down, target, flip, let go stick, roll let go stick, and action swap. Also, if you don't get arrows, um, it's actually worth to go back into room once, but more than once, it's actually slower than the backup. You can grab bombs again, and arrows. Anyways. For this trick, this is the Scarecrow skip. Um, I like to do the Japanese man setup. Uh, a few people will do this, but what you want to do is get in this corner, target, crouch stab twice, hold left, until you get to this spot, or around there. Tap up, you don't want to move that much. And then what you're going to do is follow this line right here. And you're going to hold up. Until, I think that's one frame too high. No, that's perfect. Okay. Until there. It's fairly simple. You can do it quickly. But being able to do this um, section fairly fast is important. So hold left until about... There, tap up. I like to look at the corner of that wall. Or around there. You're gonna have to like adjust sometimes. So let's see if I can get a bad angle. Or bad. So if it's like that, that I think that's the height. That's too low. So if I go one pixel up, that's two. One down. That should work. No, one too high. That should work. But um, that's pretty much the section. Pull the bomb, target shield drop, slash your sword, pull the bomb, side left. Um, go to the right there, crouch stab for that, and that's it. So let me do it one more time in a row. So I'll show you what that section looks like. It's fairly important to get comfortable with that. You want to be able to hit that every time. That was slow. You can do it in one pause, or if you're new, just do that. It's fine. So we got bombs and not magic. But let's just say I got arrows. All right, they get magic. Uh, get target into this wall. Crouch that twice. Tap up. That's too high. So I'm gonna go down. That should work. Pull the bomb, you can do this later. Target, shield, drop. I could have pulled the bomb way earlier, that was what I wasn't thinking. But um, that section is very important, practice it, get used to it, get action swap. The backup is only 15 seconds slower, so that's if you can do it quickly. I recommend doing it. Thanks for watching, I hope this helps and you guys get the trick. Hit me up on Twitch or whatever. Um, yeah, it's fairly simple. Um, hit me up if you have any questions.